Hey everybody, Claire here, and today I am gonna show you how to make salt. I know, just kidding, but seriously, it's salt. Basically, I'm gonna show you how to make fancy pants infused salt. And this makes a fantastic gift. I love getting them because it's basically just something super fun to put on top of popcorn, to finish dishes with, and it looks so beautiful. I'm also really proud of myself. I hunted the interwebs and I found these adorable vials, which I think are just gonna be gorgeous to just package the salt. So it could not be easier, it's just salt and then stuff. Um, the trick is though to choose things that will live in salt well. So you want things that are a little more fibrous and maybe more oil dense. So for instance, basil isn't a good pick. Or if you do basil, you would wanna do dried basil. You'd wanna do something that survives really well. The salt's a natural preservative, so things like lemon peel, lavender, and rosemary are gonna do very well in it, and I'm so excited to try it out. All right, so basically that's it. I'm gonna mix this all together and then basically create my little vials. So let's get started. So first, let's make the lavender salt. So these tubes carry only a very small amount, so I'm just gonna do a little at a time. So I'm gonna do about, I'd say like a teaspoon of lavender and a quarter cup of salt. And then I'm just gonna mix it together with my hands and I'm using my fingertips to break everything down. I did take this dried lavender and it's culinary lavender by the way, do not buy potpourri, buy the stuff that's meant to be eaten. And I worked it in with my mortar and pestle so I just ground it down until it was pretty soft. And that's it, so once it's really well mixed together, I'm just going to funnel it into my little tube guy here. All right, oh, these are so cute. Oh my gosh, they're even cuter than I thought they would be. That's always satisfying. So next I'm gonna do rosemary, and it's the exact same thing. It's about, it's like a teaspoon of rosemary, quarter cup of salt, and then just using my fingers, bringing it all together. You just wanna make sure to very finely chop the rosemary. Time to build. And for the last one, I'm actually just gonna zest an entire lemon and mix that with the salt to make a really delicious lemon salt. So the cuteness is overwhelming, I know, but we're gonna go like a step further and make it even more adorable because washi tape's involved. I mean, washi tape's amazing. What I like about the washi tape is, I mean, I have really terrifying handwriting, but if you had nice handwriting, you could totally use the washi tape to write onto the test tube. So I'm just gonna have it go up the side like this. So freaking cute. All right, and then I have some really nice twine, and I'm just going to use this to wrap them in a little bundle so they look gift wrap ready. And that's it. It's so cute and simple. You can give this little bundle to a host as a hostess gift. You could do a whole bunch of them if you wanted to. You could do a ton of different flavors, but I just love this idea. It's so simple, it's so easy to do, and I feel like everybody has like sea salt and herbs and they can create fun stuff like this. Well, I hope you enjoyed learning how to make this awesome little gift idea. Please post in the comments what other type of DIY videos you guys would like to see. Please like the video if you like it. Otherwise, I will talk to you later. See you soon and have a great day.